Hey guys, it's Omewrecker, and I'm playing World of Warplane today. The new release by the guys at Wargaming.net, creators of World of Tanks. And it is now fully launched. It's uh, no longer in beta. It's a free-to-play game, so you can download it uh, for absolutely free, and you will find a link to do so in the description. Uh, but what we're, we're going to do here is check out some of the mid-tier planes really quick. Um, I do have a bow fighter here that's decked out quite a bit. This is considered a heavy fighter. I have not loaded bombs or rockets on it because I do want to give the, uh, you know, the massive amount of guns on this plane a, a shot here. And because uh, it looks like there's what? Let's see. How many guns are on this thing again? It's a ton of guns. I know that. There's ten guns in the front. I'm not even kidding. Ten. Let's see. Is this four? Eight? No, I don't know where. Oh, here's four, and then there's two. I don't know. We'll we'll figure it out. We'll we'll jump into game here, and uh, yeah, we'll see how things go. Uh, but um, as you may have noticed, I do have a press count right now. I could technically be playing the jets and all that stuff, but uh, you know, considering how far out uh, those uh, jets are uh, for most players, and this even goes for War Thunder, which is obviously the the biggest competitor uh, to this game. Um, I don't want to jump to that because it would just take people so long to get to it. Uh, tier 5 aircraft are much more reasonable and uh, something that you guys could achieve, you know, a relatively short amount of time. Uh, but again, you know, I, I do have some other upgrades on it. I also applied a custom paint job. And uh, here we are, we are ticking down. You can see in the upper left uh, the breakdown of all my allies. And in the upper right, we see all of my opponents and the aircraft that they're in. And uh, let's see. This technically is an aircraft that uh, would normally have bombs and stuff to attack ground targets. And there are ground targets in this game, but um, that's not my objective at the moment. So, let's see, where are my allies? They're just kind of swinging around there. I guess, I guess we could hang out with my allies. Why not? And you see there when I use boost, if I hold W... Um, you'll see the the bar increase down there if I let that get too high My engine will overheat same goes for my weapons. Look at all those bullets You can see there that uh, those things also tick up if if they go all the way up uh, and max out then you're gonna have some issues The HUD is pretty minimal which I do appreciate and you could kind of you can see the optimal zone or you can see where you can stall out or even if you're going too fast there's indicators up there based off those arrows sliding up and down. So I am going to try to stick it out with my allies here. Oh wow, I guess we're already killing ground targets? Let's see, where are... Where are the bad guys? The mini-map, I do have to say, is a little bit difficult to see. Lower right, it's quite small. I'm guessing maybe there's a key? Oh, you could hold M. I see. Alright, so we actually do have aircraft. Oh god. Oh, well, okay, I didn't even get a chance. Oh, I got an assist for that one. That's fine. Alright, let's check that map again. Oh, we already got another fighter here. There he is. Gonna get you, brother. Come on, give me the kill. Yes! First kill! Woohoo! Awesome. And we've got another target. There's a bow fighter. Same plane as what I have. I do like to go into the fully zoomed in cam for this stuff. Oh god, it looks like he's gonna get away. Damn it. Let's check map, make sure nobody's sneaking up on us. Looks like we're fine. You can see all the ground targets there. Damn it. I wish I could hit him. He's pretty screwed anyway. He's got a bunch of aircraft on his butt. Also, this aircraft does have a tail gunner on it. Come on. <gasps> oh, we got... Ah, oh, damn it. Right as we had the opportunity to, to attack. Alright, so I do see that there's some other air targets. Let's see, where are they? That's ground. There's an air target right there. 
So we're gonna go uh, and attack him. Oh god, this Spitfire doesn't even know it's coming. Feel the pain! Damn it. No! 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 Shit! God damn it! How did I get st I guess I was just going too fast. I couldn't pull out of that dive. It's like my plane was stuck down. Uh, but I'm pretty sure we're going to win this one. It's uh, There's only two enemy planes left. There's my wreckage. Alright, so I got the assist for that. That was the Spitfire I was shooting up. And then, uh, there's one more plane somewhere. Oh god, this plane's about to go down. So here we could see, uh, you know... Oh, he's using rockets, nice. Let's see, does he have more rockets? Nope, that was his last rocket. I guess, uh, this guy's just like, I'm gonna go and destroy all these ships. While you guys go hunt that last plane. Might as well, you know, I guess they're, uh... Getting more points for it. See what else we got here. What is this, like a snowstorm going on or something? There's some sort of... Yeah, that's definitely gotta be snow. Or fog, I guess. Oh, there's the last plane. Pretty cool. Uh, one thing, though, I do notice is that, you know, for a lot of the fighters, it, it does take a lot of effort to uh, shoot down planes at times. Versus uh, in, like, War Thunder, usually it's... The other way around, sometimes you'll just get a critical hit right off the bat and uh, blow off a wing or something. Uh, in this game, it, you know, you could have critical fires, uh, for example, but um, you don't see a whole lot of, uh, you know, parts tearing off. Alright, so that was the Bowfighter. Let's go ahead and jump now into um, a Russian plane here. We're going to do the Russian Yak. This one I do have rockets outfitted on. Now, that comes at a cost a bit. Uh, you do lose some speed. Uh, or airspeed here and maneuverability for having uh, ordnance mounted onto your wings, but um, that's okay. Let's go ahead and get right back into queue. Looks like there's a lot of people now in uh, tier 5, so we got 16 people in tier 5. A good spread actually right now, if you look at uh, tiers 1 through 5, or 1 through 6 even. Uh, there are a lot of people in queue. It's the highest tiers that uh, you don't see many players in at this time, but um, also the game did just recently launch, so people are still going through progression. Alright, so we're already in. This is a national park. This is more of a... I guess a summer map, you could call it. And again, this is Yak. Pretty sweet plane. Um, this thing's got a, a nose-mounted cannon. I'm gonna see if I could show you guys. Fortunately, I can't in this screen, but uh, that, that cannon is badass. And again, with those rockets, I could use those to take out ground targets if I want. I think we're going to try to play it cool, though. You can see I've got less of a boost on this plane than the others. Let's pull up the map. Alright. Okay, so I'm going to get some altitude with my guys here. Alright, so we're headed out towards the ground targets right now. Oh, these are our bombers, aren't they? Or is that a bowfighter? It's actually hard to tell. Oh, we already have an enemy plane over here. Where is he? Oh, he's down. Alright, there's another enemy plane. And you always gotta keep your... Or be on the lookout here. Alright, so we do have some enemy fighters down there. I'm gonna try to go for this bowfighter. I'm gonna zoom in. Damn it. I'm out of juice. Come on, bow fighter. How are you going to survive all that? I wish I could smack him with a rocket. That would be so nice. Shit. And he's faster than me, so we're gonna have to break off. Oh, we got somebody going for me. So 
as you can see, it's it's uh it's more action than it is sim. We gotta get out of here. Oh god, no 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 no! Oh god, that BF one hundred nine destroyed me. That bow fighter was my downfall. Unfortunately. I like how it's got that whine that you hear in the movies as the plane goes down. Yep, and that's it for me. Oh, this is a sweet plane. What is this? Is this a BF-109? Yep, this is a BF-109 as well. That's what we got shot down by. It just has so much firepower, so many guns, and a fighter config. Oh, man! I have... Yep, he's dead. And that bow fighter's still alive! How is that bow fighter still alive? It's so crazy. Visuals are actually really good. Um, I, I, I recall them being pretty good in the beta as well, but you can see the waterfall in dis the distance and pretty good particle effects. Although I could say, you know, equally good things about War Thunder. It's really awesome though to see the return of these flight games. Oh, who's he shooting? Oh, there's a bow fighter! Awesome! That was it! That was the last aircraft. That bow fighter we tried chasing. So uh, we just got a victory for that. We got uh, currency awards and experience. So let's go ahead and jump into one more. And um, this time we're going to do the P-40 Kitty Hawk, I think. Actually, let's look really quick at... I, we did see a lot of Tier 6ers out there. Uh, let's see what we, you get at Tier 6. BF-109, there's an AGM, Spitfire 5, Mosquito. You know what, why don't we do the Spitfire 5? We'll just do the base model. This is the one that you guys will get when you unlock it. No upgrades, let's see how we can do with this thing. Spitfire was actually one of my favorite aircraft in, um, in War Thunder. Had a really, really, really good uh, climb rate. It was, uh, you know, very maneuverable. It had good weapons as well. And it looks like the spread's a little bit different this time. We got um, 72 people in queue. Only seven in uh, tier six, or actually eight now, so we'll probably find a game quickly. Uh, but what I'll do is, just in case it takes a little bit, is I will break here, and uh, once we get a match, we will be... Oh, never mind, I'm not even going to get to finish my sentence. We're already in a game. Uh, which is good. It means that there's a healthy community out there playing this right now. Uh, given that you always see, you know, at least uh, 60 plus people in queue. Alright, so we are now in our Spitfire... Uh, looks like we have eight 7.7 millimeter guns. You can see down in the left mouse button thing there. Tells us how many guns we have. No cannons though. This is strictly machine gun aircraft. And, um, is there anything else worth noting? Not really. I, I think my War Thunder Spitfire was a variant that had a cannon. Now you can upgrade your variants. Uh, there's actual tech trees in this, as I mentioned in my a beta video, and uh, it's entirely likely that there's a Spitfire in this game, or even one of higher tier that has cannons on it. Look at that. That's badass. Alright. So let's see, what do we want to do? Alright, we're going to circle around this way, actually. Going to go link up with our allies. Always pays off to, uh, you know, stick together in these types of games. I made a mistake by chasing down that uh, boat fighter before, and I split off from my allies. We're nearing stall zone there, so we're going to level out a bit. See, do we have any enemies yet? Not that I'm seeing. One guy is way out in the lead. That dude's crazy. Right now, we're just uh, trying to hunt down some enemy planes. Not seen anybody yet. Don't want to use my engine too much. Oh, there we go. There's some enemies somewhere around here. Where are they? Actually, that's a ground target. Looks like we should be coming. Oh, there he is. All right. So this is hopefully going to be our first victim. 
the P40, Kitty Hawk. Ah. Oh. Oh, we didn't get it. Looks like there's flat coming down. Uh oh, that's not good. Okay, I see another plane over there. Damn it. He's way too fast. I can't catch him. I'm stalling. Oh, God! Well, I lost a wing there, so um, I guess you do lose parts. Holy shit, what just destroyed us? An uh, ME-410, holy crap. We got destroyed. It's nice to see the vehicle damage here in action. I don't know if I've seen anything quite <laughs> at this level here. Uh, but wow, we got de totally demolished. That was cool, though. I enjoyed watching that. That's what we get for trying to chase down somebody that, that just had uh, superior speed over us. We stalled our aircraft out, so we were pretty much a sitting duck. Our plane was uh, sitting there, angled up at the sky, and uh, whoever came onto us uh, just had like a perfect, uh, you know, perfect lineup shot on us. This uh, enemy fighter, I have a feeling, is pretty screwed here. He's surrounded by allies. This is a little pea shooter, though. What is this that we're watching? It's a Yak-1. Oh! Huh. Interesting. We also got a uh, P-40. This is a Kitty Hawk. That's what we tried to shoot down before, but I think we only got the assist on. What is this? I-17? What is he... Oh, God. Well, there's another ally down. Uh, we're actually losing this. If you look at this, the uh, scoreboards, the upper left is, you know, the the grayed out ones are our destroyed planes. And uh, the lit up ones are the ones that are left. And right now our enemies have way more aircraft still left in the sky. You can see how much fire this P-51 Mustang's taken. Yeah, he's down. Oh, God. Yeah, we got crushed. Look at this. There were two pilots on the other team that had three kills. There was one who had four kills. Broken Machine, that's the guy who killed me. He had four kills by the time he got shot down. Uh, but yeah, I mean, you know, this uh, this game is, uh, you know, again out. It's available to play. And I figured the least I could do is, uh, you know, make a update video for you guys. Obviously at uh, Tier 1, um, which is what I showed in my beta video, uh, you're going to be playing these uh, biplanes. You get them for free. Uh, let's see what you get at Tier 2. Tier 2 are mostly still biplanes, although there are some fixed-wing aircraft that start to pop up. And then, uh, Tier 3... Let's see, more and more fixed-wing aircraft. Is this... This is not the Zero, I don't think. Nope. Is this the Zero? No. Uh, and, uh, we show Tier 5, so let's look at Tier 4 really quick. Is there anything I recognize? Is this the Zero? A6M1 Ryzen. Uh, this is pretty much the Zero. It's uh, The M0 is, is the Zero model, so this is actually a step ahead from what I recall. Uh, don't kill me if I'm inaccurate there, but I'm pretty sure that's the case. And yeah, you start to see, what, is this a Buffalo? Yep, that's a Buffalo. So Tier 4 is, is where you start to see more of the, uh, you know, recognizable World War II aircraft. And then from there, it's, it's more of the Legends. Uh, let's look at Tier 7 really quick, actually, before we wrap up. You got the P-51 Mustang, you got the, this is a Corsair, I can tell just from the wings. Um, IL-8, IL-10, lots of really cool aircraft start popping up in the later tiers. Uh, so again guys, this is uh, World of Warplanes, it's out now again, uh, free to play. Link in the description. Let me know what you think, and if this is a game that um, you guys have any interest in, or if you're already playing it. And uh, that's it, thanks for watching, and I will see all of you guys next time.